Hi, welcome to MGS Solutions tutorial on using the WebEx polling feature. I'm your instructor, David Godola. In this tutorial, you will learn how to set up the WebEx polling feature and use it during a meeting. To activate polling, click the View menu, click Panels, click Manage Panels. From the Available Panels window, select Polling, and then select Add. Then select OK. The polling features will show up on the right-hand side. If the polling feature does not show up, if you click on the More icon, you will see the polling option available. You will notice in the polling options, you will have a series of icons. The first icon is to open up a poll that was saved previously. The next one is to save a poll that you just created. The next one is the edit a poll. The next one is delete a poll. And then finally, move a question up or down. In order to create a question, you would need to select the type of question. The default is a multiple choice single answer. You may be able to select a multiple choice multiple answer which will give you checkbox options, and you can select a short answer, which will allow the participant to enter a answer. Click on New, and a question will show up on the upper portion of this screen. A typical question you can ask is, can you hear me? Once you've selected the question, the next thing you need to do is select the answers. From the answer section, click the add. And then you can say yes or no. If you would like to, you can select one of the answers and choose mark as correct. In order to remove that, click mark as correct again. I can now add a new question and say, can you see the presentation? And then you would again choose add an answer and select yes or no. Once you've done that, you can actually go ahead and save these questions and use them in other presentations. When you click the save icon, go to a folder where you would like to save and give it a name. As you can see, I have multiple questions that are available any time that I can use when I run a meeting. When you're ready to show the poll, there is one more option that you can select, and that's how long you want the time to be displayed. Right now, the default is five minutes. When I click the open poll, you will see the questions and the results on the right hand side. You will see who did not started, who is in progress, and who is finished, as well as the remaining time left. When the poll is finished, you can click on Close Poll. Once the Close Poll is done, the results will show up here in the poll results. When you click on Apply, you can actually share the poll results with members. You can also do individual results, correct answer, or individual grades. If you would like to edit the questions, click Edit Questions. Before you do that, you'll be asked, would you like to save the poll results? I'm going to select No. And then you can make changes to the questions. And then once you make changes to the questions, you can save once more. In order to clear this completely and start from scratch, Click on the Clear All icon, and it, would like, it asks, would you like to save? I would select No, and you can start the process again by creating new poll questions and saving them. If you want to use the poll questions during another meeting, you would click the Open icon, go to your location, and type Select the polling questions you would like to show, and then click Open Poll. So that is how you use the polling features in WebEx. Make sure you click on View, 
panels, manage panels, and make sure the polling is showing up in the current panels. I hope this tutorial was helpful. Please click on subscribe to learn about more tutorials that will be available soon. And for more information about me, check out my website at www.mgssolutions.ca. Thanks for listening, and I wish you all the best. Cheers!